as the kids got older, I, I think I realized that being in an environment um, where we were with other parents at the games was an opportunity to build relationships with other parents. Um, and it was an opportunity to be with people that I normally wouldn't be in community with. So um, my mindset going to the games was not only just wanting to watch my kids and encourage them and see them play, but also just to build a relationship with the other parents um, that were there with us and just to be intentional about having conversations and just having that opportunity for influence in their lives. I remember about five or six years ago watching a, um, a sermon series or sermon by C.J. Mahaney called Don't Waste Your Sports. And God really opened my eyes at that time. And he really used the verse, 1 Corinthians 10, 31. So whether you eat, drink, or whatever you do, do it all for the glory of God. For me, it was really, there were so many stories that, um, you know, just going to games and just watching my kids from such a critical perspective and you know just evaluating everything that was going on on the field to my and I was just personalizing it in so much where how they were performing was giving me life and was it was kind of validating you know me or um, feeding my identity I heard something one time that your, your kids will know what you value by what you praise and that would just that just resonated so much with me. And so, what am I praising? You know, between games, and what am I what am I saying? Am, am I being critical or am I just praising them? And I remember being at a, a lacrosse tournament uh, and watching my oldest son play and just feeling this all this tension. You know, I'm, and I'm isolated away from all the parents, and I'm just in, kind of in my world watching and focused on my kids and how the team's performing and god just said you got to stop this and it's your your son needs to know that you love him and that you're proud of him and that you love watching him play and i remember after that game i just pulled Derek to the side i'm sure he's thinking what are what's dad going to say to me right now and i just said to him i said i'm not going to say another word to you or i'm not going to say anything critical to you between games or after games I commit to you to say these three things. I love you, I'm proud of you, and I love watching you play.